When was the first time you realized you were Nigerian? When was the first time you realized that first things first, Niger no de carry last? But these days, so many seem to come before many of us are led to believe our glory days are long past. If I held out my hand and asked you to come with me on a journey through the past, how far back would you permit me to go before we move forward? Could we track back to the 1750s, to the gaze of Olauda Equiano, a young man from Esaka? His pen would describe his home as the largest empire in the rainforest belt of West Africa, spanning from Lagos to the River Niger, the great Benin Kingdom. With heritage rich and deep like the red soil of its people, he might tell you about the great walls of Benin, four times longer than the Great Wall of China. He might tell you of how he kicked the copper dust in protest when they stole him away and then came back for Queen Idia's ivory mask. A work of the finest art, carefully carved in the shadow of the walls of the Benin Kingdom with skills so advanced, today's scientists can scarcely wrap their minds around. Or will that be too far back? Maybe I can enlist you to journey with me to the 1940s, where we might cross paths with the lioness of Lishabi, Chief Fumilayo Ransom Kuti, the first woman in Abel Kuta to spark a car into motion, just like she sparked revolution, launched the women's union with grace, Shoyinka. One bore Fela and Nicola Kuti and the other, Gole Shoyinka. The lioness paved the way for other Amazons to tread, like Hajia Gambo Sawaba and Chief Margaret Epo. I think we are getting close. When we get to the 50s, we stomp the ground in Oloibiria and it swells in response. Our land is rich with oil, so when the sun kisses us in Kebi, Kogi, or Kolokuma, we should glisten. They listened. Chief Anthony Enahoro, Sir Abubakar Tafawa Balewa, Chief Remile Kumfani Kayade, Move the motion, play their parts for Nigeria to stand Gidigba as a giant of Africa. Independent, 1960. The world applauded with adulation. They seemed to think we had discovered what it means to be Nigerian. Staring through the 70s, 80s, I might stop and say, <laughs> Got a lot of work to do. Send out the rain. Any gonna bed. Any gonna bed. Voices that echo through our hearts as we dance to the rhythm of our stories. Songs of hope, resilience, attune the world to our glory. 1984, King Sunny Ade nominated for a Grammy. And what if I said, love me Jeje, love me tender? Do you think she should be more on Shafi or Thames? If I say, sour, 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 le, do you think Cardinal Rex Lawson or Flavor Nabania? I'm not sure real, do you think IK Dairo or Paul Play Dairo? Well, it depends. On how you remember the first phone you called your own. A dial-up, a flip, or a smartphone. Do you see now how our future stands on the shoulders of our past? How to go forward, we must first go back. But in truth, not the whole journey has been a blast. Several stops along the way have left us aghast. The Nigeria where one dollar was exchanged for less than a naira seems so far beyond our reach. The days when Niger diaspora rushed back home after school seem a myth. Tribal wars, inflation, no safety on our streets. These days, people are running out of reasons to stay or commit. We hear it in the wind. Feel it beneath our toes, the red soil stained with the sacrifice of the innocent. The world watches as the giant seems to crumble to her knees. But first, they ask for all the jewels that adorn her neck, the best of our assets, to fortify and pioneer themselves, since they self no say, Nigerno de Karila. 
Agbara lolomuwa. A ram retreats to gather strength, not to surrender. Yes, the land on which our dreams were planted has been trodden on, but in various fields, Adiche, Agbani, Aminat, J. Muhammad are still breaking ground. Alas, the seeds of the labor of our heroes past did not die. They are the roots from which our glowing future will grow. Nigerians continue to awe with creativity and resilience wherever we go. Chinue Achebe told us once, the time to do something about water rising is when it is at your ankle, not when it is up to your neck. Like a train with no brakes is an idea whose time has come. All aboard! The time is now. Done your crowns, kings and queens. It is in our hands to birth a future that the ones to come can be grateful for. Cynthia Daya, by Yashara Daki. A single broomstick does not sweep a room. Igwe Buike, we are greater than the sum of our parts. Agbajo Wola Fin Soya. You cannot beat your chest with one finger. Kete, kete, it won't sat. Though we may not come from the same house, since we are community, we are together. Though the gust of life may blow us a million ways, Agaracha must come back. Can you think of anyone worthy but not yet mentioned? Then you see that so many of us must work together for Nigeria to be worthy of mention. With the wisdom of the old and the strength of the young, put your hand in mine, let us rise together. The time has passed for nonchalance. This is the Niger Renaissance. Rebirth, reminisce, revolutionize. Nigerians do not need permission to be, to overcome, to prevail. Put your hand in mine. Let us go back to the future together. And in the words of the late, great Onyeka Owenu, One love, keep us together, live in a world, it's a struggle to stay alive. But one love, keep us together. Let us go back to the future together.